Good morning, Southwest Water. I'm Fox 4 meteorologist Trent Eric, and right now we're looking across the bridge there towards North Fort Myers. This camera sits on top of the luminary, and we are mostly dry. And unlike the last couple of days where we've seen lightning off in the distance, we are not seeing lightning. We are not seeing any type of rain along the coastline. That's a nice little change to help get you to and from work here this morning. And it looks like drop off for the little ones at school is going to be just fine. A couple of showers way out of the over the Gulf of Mexico. And as we look ahead here, we should be dry not only this morning, but for that evening commute home as our rain chances today are going to stay really, really low. Here's 10 o'clock, all sunshine, but notice the streamlines. Those winds are going to come in out of the northeast today. That's going to bring in some drier air. It's going to bump our rain chances down and give us an even nicer weekend. You can see a couple of isolated showers, maybe a rumble of thunder there, uh, but most of us are going to be dry. Our temperatures this morning in the low 70s near the lake, mid to upper 70s along the coastline. That reading a 76 Six and page field is still too above our average of 74, but it does feel just a little different out there this morning as dew point values are in the low to mid 70s instead of upper 70s to low 80s. So it's subtle, but it is a little bit of a change. We are dealing with some fog from Immokalee all the way up through LaBelle and Moorhaven, where visibility has dropped to three quarters of a mile right along the lake. So if you are driving here uh, between Moorhaven and LaBelle, just know it's going to be a little slower here this morning. The good news is for our main arteries there, I-75 and Tamiami Trail, we are still looking at decent conditions. Now the wind is going to come northeast today, and it's all about that direction, bringing in that drier air, and that's going to dump our rain chances down to 30% today, 20 to 30% chance over the weekend, and you can see a glimpse at Saturday. We wake up with all sunshine. We'll see a couple of showers, maybe a thunderstorm or two as we go throughout the evening hours, and that's going to be about it. A couple areas in the tropics, remnants of Gordon, another area just to the West. No need to worry about these two, but the one to our south over the weekend on social media, you're going to start to hear some chatter. Next week, we are likely going to be dealing with a tropical system. Helene is the next name up on the list. We'll start to see these numbers increase here over the weekend, and the computer models are pulling this system north. Now, here's the problem. Until we get a low or some type of circulation, it's impossible to know how far east or west this system could possibly be. Just know that we're watching it here over the weekend, and it's a really good idea idea to stay with weather and of course check back in with me on Monday morning. I want to get you to the seven day real quick. Showers and thunderstorms way down here over the weekend and we will start to see that cloud cover and our chance of rain go up middle of the week.